Okay. Hey guys, how's it going? It's Matt from Fidelity Gaming TV, and welcome to this 2015 edition of the MLB Trade Deadline. Thank you for joining us. Today we have a very special trade to announce between your San Diego Padres and the New York Mets. Here it is. The San Diego Padres will be receiving starting pitcher prospect Noah Syndergaard in return for Tyson Ross and Will Venable. This is shocking news, yes. Here is the thing behind this, guys. The Padres have a lot of players in their final year of their contracts. Now, if you're not a super baseball geek, that basically means at the end of the year, the Padres are going to be most likely losing a lot of players. They are not going to be able to resign everybody before free agency. This means we need to shed some salary and try to get as much space as possible for us to resign the main players next year that are going to want big contracts, for example, Justin Upton and Will Myers. And to do this, we are going to need to shed some salary cap space. So what we have decided to do is send over Tyson Ross and Will Venable. Now Tyson Ross was our hidden gem this season, he really performed well. 84 overall, only 27 years old, and um, you know, I just, I really do hate giving him away, but at the same time, we can get a lot in return for him. So we will be packaging him up here with Will Venable, the 77 overall left fielder, 32 years old of age, see potential. Um, honestly, we just had a tough time fitting him into the lineup, so um, this wasn't too hard for me to send him off. It was just kind of the finishing touches needed to receive Noah Syndergaard. And these two together, um, even though they're leaving us, are going to bring us a very, very good pitching prospect. But I use the word prospects um, with a light sense because Syndergaard actually is going to be called up. So here's Noah Syndergaard, A potential, 78 overall, only 21 years old. He is, in my opinion, ready for this rotation as we look to become younger. And yeah, he will definitely get called up right away. Look at these attributes. They're just amazing. Um, in real life with the Mets, he's doing very well. And I think he will do well with us in this game. So that is the trade. Tyson Ross and Will Venable are leaving the Padres for the Mets in return for Noah Syndergaard. And I guess what I have to say about this is I'm happy. Um, I know we did have to give away Tyson Ross, but at the same time, Noah Syndergaard is going to be a much better pitcher than Tyson Ross. He can prove to be very worthy with, uh, for us, and he's going to fit right into this rotation as he will be the first of our pitching prospects to be called up as we have lots of them now kind of reshaping this San Diego Padres farm system. So he will crack the rotation, and this is what it looks like. So he will come in as the number five pitcher for now. Although at the end of the season, I believe we are going to be losing uh, one or two of these pitchers from the starting rotation, not James Shields, uh, between Ian Kennedy, Corey Lupke, and Andrew Kashner. So we're gonna have to see who we lose, but Syndergaard is staying. He is in his final year, but him along with the other two pitching prospects, Henry Owens and Casey Kelly, are going to be locked up this offseason as they're all in their final years. But they will not want too many or too much money, so we will lock them up, and that is the rotation for AAA. It's looking good, guys. The future for the Padres is looking good, as well as the current present time. So they will continue in their playoff run, pretty much 20 games above 500, actually exactly 20 games above 500, 62 and 42. As the next episode, you will guys will see Noah Syndergaard make his MLB debut here with the Padres against Matt Latos and the Miami Marlins. A rematch, but this time it's in Miami. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please drop a like. It is very much appreciated. Otherwise, I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe. Peace.